Okay, this is the reverse osmosis, uh, the main unit, as we call it, which has just been taken out of the box. Um, the first thing to note is that this is the membrane. This housing here houses the membrane, which you can see in here, the membrane filter, which is the most important part of the unit, really. Um, and the membrane cap, you might need to put that on. Um, simply just screw it on like that, and that's all you need to do. And inside there's uh, some silicon gel inside the screw thread. You can also add some Vaseline, a couple of dabs of Vaseline if you want. And all it does is makes it easier to open up in three to five years when you need to uh, change the membrane. And you'll know when it's time to change the membrane because the, the water will taste really foul. And after drinking the purified water, you will really tell the difference. So the next thing is check out these clips. This is where these two filters are going to go. Now this is uh, in the instructions it says filter 1. This is the also referred to as the white and the blue filter and um, this is the uh, post filter and this is the brown filter also known as filter 2 and it's also known as the remin or the remineralizer filter. This puts the minerals back into the system and basically they clip on top like this. The clue as to which way they go, note they've both got different ends, they've both got either elbows or um, push fit ports. So the clue is which way they go is that, see these two elbows on the side of the uh, membrane housing, the elbows go on that side. Okay, so we're going to now clip them on. The brown one goes on this side, so we're gonna, let's do that one first. And let's just get these out of the way. Now, they, sh they can just clip on like that, but it's much easier and more stable if you actually take these clips off and stick them on the, on the unit like that. And then um, stick that on there. Hold the, hold the unit while you're doing it. Just maneuver them on. Then we want to take off these clips and do the same with the, with the white filter. And just checking it's going the right way. Whoops, the way the elbows are going the right way, we basically clip it on. And uh, we never drop the clips. And let's put that on there. You might want to change, you know, you can maneuver these around to make it fit neatly. Yeah, just push them up and down. So there we have it. These are now sitting pretty on top there. The next thing we want to do is join these two up with this little blue tube. So we to do that you need to get the elbows just point them together in the same direction by twisting them then bring them up together and literally when they're together just push them in like that okay you know that they're fitted because you try and pull them apart and you see these two little push grip collets will be stopping them coming out all right if you want to somehow get this back out you push the collet in while you're pulling push the collet in while you're pulling and it will eventually come out yeah, you've got to hold it in on both sides, but we don't need to do that for now. So that is step one. We put the filters on top of the unit, pointing the right way. Okay, so let's see how all the tubes connect up. So obviously here you have the, these two filters are joined with that small tube. Then underneath you've got, coming from the membrane, you have this one here, which is basically, this is, goes towards the drain clamp that's under your sink usually that's where the excess water goes out of there so that's where you connect the long tube to the drain clamp then here the four-way connector which you can just about see there uh, the blue tube goes up towards the t-piece and the t-piece goes into the brown the brown remineralizer filter and this is where you connect the long tube towards the tank the tank okay uh, underneath here while well, we've got it this piece goes into the membrane and just in case you can see it this piece here this is the inlet so that comes that's where your main water comes in yeah from your saddle valve or water connectors might you might understand it and then finally up here the white filter this goes towards your drinking water tap so that's where you put the long tube and that's it.